Hey everyone, Kamara Real here. I'm just gonna go ahead and get this Fortnite Kovacs FPS Aim Trainer Guide out so that people can start practicing with their correct sensitivities in Fortnite. So let's, without further ado, let's go ahead and get on with this. You wanna go to Game Options, Weapons, Hide Weapon, make sure this, this is checked. Then you go to Video, put in your resolution. You can do, you know, full screen 1444 by 1080, you know, full screen 1920 by 1080, whichever one you like. I'm not going to do that just because I don't want my OBS to crash. You go to Game Options, you go to Main, go ahead and make it Clamped Horizontal 80. Clamped Horizontal 80 is correct for Fortnite in 16x9 and thinner aspect ratios. And Vertical 50 point. 50.534 is correct for Fortnite in 16x9 or wider aspect ratios. However, if you if you play you know 1080, if you play 1920 by 1080, then you would just use 80, and you would do clump horizontal. Now the part that gets a lot of people is the sensitivity. Now convertible, how do I get my how do I get my correct sensitivity? Well, you can actually get sensitivity a lot more correct than you think using other tools. In Fortnite, you have stuff like. 0.4 sensitivity or 0.10 sensitivity, but you never actually know if it's exactly that. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and look at how we can get those exact numbers. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started on that. Let me go ahead and minimize this. Alright, so let's go ahead and go into this directory right here. You're local and you're saved. Then you want to go to cloud and you want to click on the most recent one. I guess that's the most recent one for me. You're gonna need to know this. You can go ahead and copy this. And you're going to have to download a program that extracts and you can go into this, which I'm going to do here. And you'd open this up. Once you've opened this up, file, open. You can go ahead and open that right there or you can just do it the other way and just drag and drop I'm pretty sure. If it doesn't let you drag and drop, then it will. So I'm going to go ahead and open a client setting from a pro player that I have. Let's see, who do I want to open? Uh, we'll go with. We'll go with this one. All right. So as you can see here, you have your targeting sensitivity, your exact mouse, your exact. Uh, mouse X and Y. I'm going to take these numbers and if you want to practice your targeting sense you would take this number and you multiply it by this and then you have your mouse targeting X. Because mouse sensitivity to be X by targeting slow if you multiply those two then that's that's gonna be your exact ADS X. So let's go ahead and go back into here and you would just multiply on a calculator those two numbers. So I'm going to go ahead and do that off screen here. Alright, so then you take this number, go ahead and paste that there. That's that's the conf you use. And this is your ADSX. And you go back into Kovax. And then you put that there. Now you need to get your ADSY. Same same thing. Go back into the extractor. There you go. And that should be exact. Then you can go ahead and go into Tile Frenzy and basically you're trying to you know, go challenge. I already have a guide in my Discord for exclusive resources and you can just use the, uh, the guide there to track your progress. It's a fully compatible tracker. All you have to do is just follow the tutorial for that and you're going to be able to create really complex graphs and track your own improvement. And if you don't want to 
Uh, if you're a pro player and you don't want to go through you know, downloading all this stuff, all you need to do is just give me your save file and I can get you the, the correct sensitivities for this, no problem. So just go ahead and go ahead and comment if you have any questions. And I guess that's pretty much it. Enjoy.